Uh, well, we said we were going to get a little tighter, tighter shot. Can you see right there? This certifies that there is on deposit in the Treasury, right, of the United States of America. So now notice a couple of key features. This will be the part two. So see the part one, right? You see in silver, right, in silver. Everybody likes to talk about money, right? But let's really talk about real, real money. Right, and what is not real money, right? Payable, right, to the bearer on demand, right? Notice over there what it says. It says this certificate, the key word here, right, the key word here is this, this certificate, right, certificate down here, $1, right, $1 in silver payable to the bearer on demand. That means the bearer of this can go and demand that from the what? The Treasury. The Treasury of who? Of who? The United States of America. In fact, when they talk about good old days from an economic monetary system, that this was the good old days. When we talk about so-called good old days, all right? Not the good old days just of everything in America. Come on now. The, the Holocaust of the Beit Israel, the black sheep. No, that wasn't a Holocaust. Are we Ethiopian Hebrews? No. It was a Holocaust. Right? But, but we still give thanks because that was a fulfillment of biblical prophecy. Even though a lot of people are trying to suppress that and trying to deny the truth because they haven't received the love of the truth, let's just deal with this truth right here. All right, so here we have right here. So you see New York, New York, New York, blah, 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 blah. Right? So you see New York, New York right there. And why, why the B? B is for Babylon. Yes, B is for Babylon. Believe it or not, like it or not, hold on for a moment. Believe it or not, like it or not, the B is for Babylon. Okay, hold on for a moment. Let me move this. All right, let me move this over here. And let me move that right there. And let me put this more like this. All right, so here we go. Okay, it's a little more firmer. All right, terra firma. Africa. They know that. They want that's what they want to keep you hoodwinked, bamboozled. You know what I'm saying? Talk a lot of people. Anyway, I'll get into that. All right, so this this certificate, right? This certificate, this right here says what what down here? It don't say none of that. It says Federal Reserve. So notice where's the treasury on this? It's not talking about it's a whole different it's a change of um promise or oh, it's a change of uh of, of, of agreement. Now, we do notice some differences in the design, like this part here. I don't know if anybody has touched on that. This part here is a little different. The circle around here is a little bit different. You, you notice it's, it's not so here, right? You see the difference there? Up here is a little different in the original, in the original currency. And the whole story about what, what happened back in uh, – um, FDR's time and, and the Great Depression. Some say this is what we're going through right now, economically speaking, in America. But it's very important that we don't fool ourselves. You see one is down here. Notice how it's reemphasizing the one, the one here. Over here on this one, you don't see that. You see the difference? This is not a circle. In fact, this is like almost like a five-pointed star if you, if you study the shapes. This has like a fiveness to it. If you think about it, you understand it's almost like the the Pentagon upside down. Here, this is a this is a this is like more like an oval. But I'm sure there's others who go into much more detail, and they probably have um, corollary documents to back up. We're just observing these things that's on the surface, right? Um, you see the one right here. You go down here. There's no one over here. There's no one. So 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 notice that here they got an F. I noticed. Huh. You could just imagine. All right. Um, okay, there we go. I had to flick that one off. They want to flick us off. You understand? Um, so you see Washington here. That's Washington. You seen that picture where Washington is like the goat? People say, well, but they did that. He's not really, he's really a good blah, blah, blah. Yeah, all right. Anyway, um, say it's you because people, most people don't over, understand what we're saying here. And they'll watch and they'll deny it. They'll make all sort of poppycock excuse. Or they'll try to say, 
because they are devil's advocates. What can you do about it? In spirit, in soul, in body, in the Trinity, there's much you can do about it. Um, but they don't want you to really think about that. That's why they get to keep you caught up. Now, it says here, this note, notice the, the change of language. Look up legally. The difference between a certificate, right, a certificate, and a note. So people are carrying around, actually, people are carrying around for themselves, they were carrying around certificates in their pockets, not just notes. Now when you talk about, oh, I got some money, you really are just talking about notes. All you got is a bunch of notes. So instead of giving me five dollars, give me five notes, right? Give me some notes. How much notes you got, right? How much notes you got? There's still dollars. It still says dollar here. You know what I'm saying? But there's difference. If you notice down here, this is just one dollar, right? Over here it says one dollar, right? But then it has payable, right? Well, in silver, payable. In silver. That's the key right there. In silver, right? Did I get that? You see that? In silver. Payable. In silver payable. Now let's look at the reverse. I want to get a little tighter angle. Now you now everybody has talked about the opine on the one God. Right? In God we trust. Right? I know there'll be much more we'll see in this too, but just recently examining the two, because we will look at them separately. You know what I mean? You look at this one over here, then you look at this one over there. What's very, very interesting from what we can observe is that both the front, the, the, both fronts are different. There's differences, key differences. But the back, the back is, is, is not so much, there's not so many differences with the back. But there's only one major back we notice, or ba major difference, right? Major difference that we notice, right? Uh-huh. That's the silver um, certificate. And this is the federal note. The note has given you, I mean, the federal government has given you a note. And you see that I, Zechariah, Zacharias, chapter 5 and 6. We, we touched on that uh, previously, right? That's that I. And what does that signify? It signifies their dishonest trading. You know, I heard one, um, I think it was uh, Sheikh, uh, Sheikh, uh, uh, Imram Hussein, he did a documentary, not a documentary, a lecture. It's called um, Islam and the Monetary System. Some information we've seen before, but looking at everybody's perspective, irrespective of, you know, maybe their religion, sometimes looking at other people from other religious perspectives is interesting. You understand? I mean, looking at, well, how do they look at the truth and what does it reflect and highlight? But anyway, he was talking about, like, how if you have a million of these, or not a million, he, he got some money, right? It was a, a, kind of a parable in a sense uh, that he was giving on hadith on that level. Anyway, he got some money, and he wanted to buy a, 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 a camel, right? He had enough money to buy a camel, so he put it up under his bed. And then a while later, maybe a couple of months or whatever later, he went to buy that camel. And then he told his wife, you know, like, um, wife, um, when I went to buy the camel, I could only get a donkey. And then he put the money out for a little bit longer, right? And then he went back. He couldn't get a donkey no more, right? He could only get maybe a, maybe, maybe a, a sheep or get down to goat or maybe a dog. You understand? That's dishonest trading. Now, silver doesn't do that. Notice that. Silver and precious metals don't do that. They might fluctuate within the measure but they still have intrinsic value. So what's backing this dollar up is basically belief, and it shows so when he put in God we trust. People say, well, because our money is, is more holy money, because it has in God. Which God? What's the name of your God? And don't go through all the one, the same God, because the Bible says the God of the world is the devil who blinds their minds to seeing the truth. That's why people can't really, they'll watch this, they'll watch other things, they'll read other things, and still say, I don't see the difference. Do you see the difference right here? Because it was silver backing it, payable in silver. They didn't have to use the God thing. They didn't put God in God we trust back it. It said one, just one. You know, almost like we do as, as, as brethren and as 
as lost, found people, we say one, and we give a bounce. One, yo, one. You understand? Yeah, I'm out. All right, one. You understand? Then go through all that, you know, religious con game here. You know what I'm saying? You see this right here? In God we trust. There's no in God we trust this. So people don't think there's no... I'm unable to come to the phone to speak with you. Uh, I just call them to me. Please leave your name and number, and I'll get back to you as soon as...